Welcome back to Every Disney Movie Ever. My name is Jess and I'm watching Every Disney Movie Ever. Today I'm going to talk about Mighty Ducks the Movie The First Face Off. Mighty Ducks the Movie The First Face Off is a 1997 directed video release. It is, however, comprised of three episodes from the animated series. Directors include Joe Baruso, Doug Murphy, Blair Peters, and Bayakup Song. Joe Baruso is best known for Where in the World is Carmen San Diego, NASCAR Racers, 321 Penguins, and this. Doug Murphy is best known for Batman, The Mask of the Phantasm, Young Justice, X Men Evolution, and Wolverine and the X Men. Blair Peters is best known for Kid vs. Cat, My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, Being Ian, and Class of the Titans. Bayakup Sung is best known for Gargoyles, Aeon Flux, Spiral Zone, and this. Supervising animators include Cullen Blaine, Terrence Harrison, Eddie Hutchins, Jane Gill Kim, Terry Lennon, and Karen Peterson. Cullen Blaine is best known for Rotor, The Get Along Gang. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and The Secret Sundays. Terrence Harrison and Eddie Hutchins have covered in previous videos. They'll be listed and linked in the description. Jane Gil Kim is best known for Star Chaser, The Legend of Orin, Kim Possible, Transformers Prime, and X-Men Evolution. Terry Lennon is best known for Phineas and Ferb, G.I. Joe, The Lord of the Rings, and The Transformers. Karen Peterson is best known for Muppet Babies, The Transformers, Space Cats, and Robocop Alpha Commando. The film was edited by Robert S. Burchard, who I covered in the video about DuckTales, Church of the Golden Suns. The link will be in the description. The music was by Patrick DeRemmer, who is best known for a goofy movie, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, All Creatures Big and Small, and The Most Beautiful Girl in the World. The film was written by Garfield Reeves Stevens, Judith Reeves Stevens, and David Wise. Garfield and Judith are sometimes a writing team and sometimes not. Obviously on this they work together, so things they've also worked on together are Primeval New World and Star Trek Enterprise and this. David Wise is just known for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Buck Rogers of the 25th Century, Beastmaster 3, The Eye of Braxis, and Wonder Woman. The film stars Ian Ziering, Steve McCall, April Winchell, Jennifer Hale, Brad Garrett, Jeff Bennett, Jim Belushi, Tim Curry, and Dennis Franz. Ian Ziering plays Wild Wing and is best known for the Sharknado franchise and Beverly Hills 90210. Steve McCall plays Nosedive and he's best known for Avenging Angelo, Stealing Cars, Dead Man on Campus, and this. April Winchell, Jeff Bennett, and Tim Curry I've covered in previous videos. They'll be listed in the, link in the description. Jennifer Hale plays Mallory and is best known for the Mass Effect trilogy, Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker, and Ralph Breaks the Internet. Brad Garrett plays Grin and he's best known for Everybody Loves Raymond, Christopher Robin, Tangled, and Ratatouille. Jim Belushi plays Phil and he's best known for Red Heat, Retroactive, Little Trouble Fours, and Trading Places. Dennis Franz plays Captain Cleghorn and he's best known for NYPD Blue, City of Angels, Die Hard 2, and Dress to Kill. As I said, this direct video release is a few episodes from the animated series. It is comprised of the two-part pilot, so that's two episodes, and then when they were releasing it as a movie they decided to add episode 25 called Duck Hard as the third episode to like finish off the dragon, Draconis, whatever the guy's name is, Dragonus storyline, I don't know. And um, I've never seen this show. Uh, I had no idea what to expect. I kind of went in super blind like gargoyles. So I was kind of excited because I was like, oh, maybe I'll like it better than the movies. And that is an absolute no. I don't know what I would have ever expected, but this was not it. I had no idea. <laughs> that the Mighty Ducks television series, the ducks were aliens from another planet and they were like superheroes and hockey players. I, who decided this? Like who, <laughs> well, it's not a good concept for a show in my personal opinion. I thought it was gonna be like set in the same universe that like Darkwing Duck and DuckTales and Chippendale and like all those shows where the animals are alive or like freaking Tailspin, all the animals are alive and it's not weird. But no, this is like, they come to earth as aliens and they're just talking ducks and everyone's just cool with them being the Anaheim duck like no <laughs> it's it's not good the story itself is so forced together and so much exposition because so much has to happen in such a short amount of time gargoyles as we know has become one of my favorite like was five episodes like the first five episodes of the series was were all connected and the same storyline and that is a flushed out actual film that's very good and sets up the whole concept of gargoyles really well this tries to explain to you that the ducks are from another planet and have crash landed on earth because of this other evil being and like all try to do that in two episodes and then the third episode is just another part of the series 
And it was so much information. There was so much expository dialogue of just like, this was our leader. He defeated this person. And we're ducks from another planet. And blah, 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 blah. And it was just painful. Which is sad because I really love a good ensemble. I was excited about, you know, the different personalities and characters and all that kind of stuff. But, oh, no, I can understand why this was only one season. Absolutely not. That's everything I have for Mighty Ducks, the movie, the first face off. <laughs> My final rating is four planets out of ten, and that's really generous. The animation saved it a little bit. Our total movie count is Parent Death Tone and Cry Counters are the same. If you want to keep up with the movie I'm watching when, follow me on Instagram or Twitter. You'll find out what movie I'm watching when. I put up videos every Monday and Friday and sometimes on Wednesday. Join my Patreon. I'm excited to keep doing requests and just bonus stuff over there because it's a good time. There's four tiers and lots of fun bonus stuff. Until next time, come like subscribe, but I'm not in charge of your life. You are. So you do you and don't be dragonous about it or whatever his name is, I guess. It's so weird to be my friend. Okay. <laughs>